If you're alone and find yourself swimming, you'll have to perform a self-rescue to get back in your kayak. Here's the breakdown. Set up your paddle float, flip the kayak, use your paddle as an outrigger, pull yourself onto the kayak, and slide into the cockpit. Simple, right? Let's take a closer look at those steps. As soon as you're back above the water, get a hold of your paddle and your kayak and grab your paddle float. Then hook your leg inside the cockpit to free up your hands. Slide the blade into the float and make sure to attach the clips to secure it to the paddle. Now it's time to get the kayak upright. Reach under the boat and grab the cockpit combing on the far side. Pull it toward you while you push up on the near side of the kayak and voila! Now move to the stern and lay your paddle behind the cockpit with the blade just on the far side of the combing. Hold the paddle and the combing in one hand to keep it in place and reach across the deck to find something to hold onto. Give a big kick or climb onto your paddle so you can pull yourself onto the rear deck. Keep your weight low and stay on your belly while you spin around to slide your legs into the cockpit. And remember to lean onto the paddle for stability. Once your legs are in, twist around so you're sitting in the kayak. Now that you're back in, stow your paddle so you can pump the water out of your boat and put your skirt back on. You'll want to practice your self-rescue technique so it's ready when you need it. And it's a good idea to have a friend on hand to help you out. To learn how to do a wet exit or a tea rescue, check out these videos or click here to find a class near you.